to my channel. This is Roman Ivanov, and again, we're talking about neighborhoods. Today, we're in Hollywood, one of the biggest neighborhoods in Miami. Right now, I'm on Broadwalk. This is the most popular tourist destination of the whole Hollywood. I want to show you everything about Hollywood, from tourist destinations to living to restaurants and everything in between. So follow me, and I'll hope you enjoy the tour. Explain why Hollywood Broadwalk bringing hundreds of thousands of tourists a year. Let me start with some stats. Number one, it's two and a half miles long. It consists of over 50 beautiful restaurants, three huge resorts, over 30 small hotels, and 30 boutique shops. It has beautiful sand beaches and of course the ocean. I want to show you is this banya. That's some kind of Russian spa or Russian sauna. And it's very interesting. You're in Miami on the beach when it's 100 degrees outside and you still want to get warmer. Right behind me, Margaritaville, the largest resort on the Broadwalk. This is not just four star hotel, it's a combination of entertainment, live music restaurants and a beachfront. I'd like to share some history of Hollywood with you. As a real estate agent, I love historic buildings and that building behind me belonged to Joseph Young, the founder of Hollywood. He came here in 1920 and poured millions of dollars in order to build the city of his dream. He named it Hollywood by the Sea. He built this building in 1925. It's the same year he became the first mayor of Hollywood. Touring Homes of Hollywood. This listing available for sale. The address is 1050 Polk Street. It's three bedrooms, two baths, beautiful home, priced at $890,000. Let's go see it. Please welcome into the house.
right now I'm in Hollywood East, more of a middle price range neighborhood. And that house right behind me, 1422 Scott Street, was my listing back in 2019. I listed at 500K, and then pandemic hit, I got to take it off the market, a seller wants to hold, and now I'm planning to relist it. So just imagine how much money the seller gained for three years owning it. Put it in comments below. Let me know what's your thoughts. Would you like to see another house? Here is the one, 30 to 12 Cali Largo, also in Hollywood. It's priced at 70 to 75, features three bedrooms, two and a half baths, a pool, updated kitchen. Why are we still talking? Let's go see it. This home features open floor plan, and I love the flow of it. You'll be amazed how much space you have in the living room. It offers a ton of cooking space and extra island, so you don't need to have formal dining area, but you do have it. to show you the master bedroom with dedicated master bathroom. You can get all this just for 775,000. Isn't that a good deal? Right now I'm in the heart of Hollywood, Young Circle, and as you can see, Joseph Young greeting us here. You remember, I showed his house early in this video. Young Circle is an attractive place to live in because it's convenient. On one circle you'll find everything you need from nail salons to restaurants to grocery stores. So, the building right behind me is a rental, and rent starts here from $1,700 for one bedroom. And if you want to have two bedrooms, two baths, you have to pay 3,000 bucks and up. So uh, you know that it's expensive, but they mostly rent it out, everything they have. Right behind me, the stage where a lot of performance happening almost every week. So people from surrounding buildings can come here and enjoy concerts for free. If you move to Hollywood, 
Hollywood, you'll find over 60 parks and seven golf courses in there. This is my favorite part. Guess how I pronounce it? Kape Kigi Yugni. No one can pronounce that, so we call it TY. Everything you see behind me is Hollywood. It's a beautiful place to live in, so consider moving to Hollywood after seeing this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next neighborhood.